The Guyanese famed El Dorado rum is making its debut in the Belize market. The rum is being imported into Belize by Grace Kennedy, which today organized a training for bartenders at Club Calypso in Belize City. That session will be followed by others in San Pedro and Cayo. Duane Moody caught up with the folks from Grace Kennedy Limited. A new liquor is about to hit the shelves of your local supermarkets. It's El Dorado, a high-end rum out of Guyana that's smooth and rich in fruity flavors. Grace Kennedy is the distributor, and on Wednesday, El Dorado will be launched at the Sixth Lounge. Brand manager for Grace Beverage Center, FN Paris, spoke of the excitement surrounding its introduction into the wide variety of local and foreign liquors in Belize. Um, it doesn't really cater for everybody. Um, you know, I mean, everybody has different tastes, um, and El Dorado is one of those that um, is an acquired taste, pretty much. Um, we have a, a, a wide range of a wide range um, in terms of the sipping rums. We also have pouring rums, um, and we also have some liqueurs that we brought in. Um, and and for us, it's important because we just wanted to show uh, and to bring in one more option of rums, pretty much, into the country um, for people to be able to, to familiarize themselves. An entirely new option for rum consumers and those that have an appreciation for liquors, El Dorado comes in various tastes and ages. World Ambassador for El Dorado, Stephanie Holt, spoke of the differences of the Guyanese spirit when compared with similar liquors. And it's made from uh, Demerara sugar, so it's rich brown sugar. It's a little bit fruitier than other sugars. It comes from the river that's next to the distillery in Guyana. Um, and we use the only wooden stills in the world. We use American oak barrels to age it. And it makes it really sweet and fruity and soft. Uh, so it's, uh, it's perfect. Uh, people over here apparently have a, a nice sweet palate, so I think they quite like it. Here, the, the rum flavor gets a lot of it, so from the barrel. Uh, so you're getting a lot of kind of vanilla, butterscotch, and chocolate kind of flavors. Our rums have those flavors, but they also have kind of raisin and apricot and orange peel kind of flavors nice. mixed in too. And today, in one of the many training sessions being held around the country, bartenders from various hotels, restaurants, and bars received tips on creating mixed drinks with El Dorado. They tested the distinctive tastes of the liquor and gave it a thumbs up. They brought us in to give us different briefing on them. They had us sampling the different rum and they had cocktails that they made with them, which were really good. And they brought in a lot of different rums that we import from foreign places such as Canada, such as um, America, from Europe. And they had them compare, compare them to the El Dorado. And surprisingly, the El Dorado was very much good. The quality it was really good. Yeah, there are a few of them that I hadn't tasted before, like uh, the 12 year. There are different uh, types of, of it. So uh, my the best one I like was the 12 years uh, old. So uh, and there are many more. And uh, tell us about the. I know it's a very unique liquor. Um, do you think that your clients there at Thursday Thursday will be receptive to to its unique taste? Yes, they will because there are some of them that they are uh, smooth tasting and there are other ones, uh, especially religion people, they like the strong taste. So mm -hmm. there are, there is one that it's really excellent. It's uh, It has one measure along with the other ones which really, uh, it has a the hint. So no. I know religion people will definitely like it. With with this rum particularly, they will be um, you know we'll be doing much more training session after this week around. Um, so people will be able to familiarize themselves. And of course, you know we carry our carry bear and we carry um, the Mackesin and Shandy. So um, we do have a wide range now and, and we definitely will continue to build on those. Apart from Belize City, training sessions will also be done in San Pedro and Cayo. Dwayne Moody for News Five. The cost of the rum is in the range of $37 to about $150.